Well, hello, this is uh, John Perham here. Um, today I'm going to say a few words about applications of Eigen systems, and the two applications we're going to look at are problems 92 and 93 from the Math 2019 tutorial uh, at the School of Mathematics and Statistics at the University of New South Wales. Well, the reason for this video is that we we're unable to finish these two problems. Um, due to the time taken in carrying out the technical computations. And these problems involve two important applications of eigenvalues and eigenvectors. The first is about the transformation of quadric surfaces defined by quadratic forms to forms relative to their principal axes. The second is about the solution of systems of linear first order differential equations with constant coefficients. These solutions have been produced using the computer algebra system Mathematica, using it to automate the tedious and repetitive computations involved in the manual solution, rather than using the advanced tools provided by the system as black boxes. The result is a set of generic tools which can be easily customized to similar applications. I've also taken the opportunity to visualize, visualize some aspects of the solutions. Please note that all equations are are of the form left-hand side equals zero, so that only the left-hand side is given or needs to be given. So anyway, let's look at the first application, or the first problem, um, which is uh, uh, formulated here. So uh, this is a matrix, um, which we can visualize using this. And um, we can see that it it's, um, it's symmetric. This element's the same as this one, and this one, and this one, and so on. So we expect that its eigenvalues will all be real, and we have to show that they are, in fact, uh, 1, minus 4, and 3, and find the corresponding eigenvectors. So uh, let's uh, pause that. <coughs> 